Potato. Potato. Are we recording? Yes. Okay. We should probably start. We should. Yeah. Hello, Internet Land. How are you doing today? What's going on tonight, buddy? What you got on the plan? What, what's in, what's in the old schedule for Mr. Max Kent tonight? The school is doing a big Halloween thing. They're doing a what? Yeah, your school? Yeah. Your school has not forbidden Halloween. No. That's good news. Uh huh. And if I understand correctly, you cleared it with your teacher to put what on your face today? Scary, scary makeup. Scary, scary makeup. So we're going to show you a few little like tricks that we have for doing latex uh, and, and other stuff in today's video. And we're going to zombify Max. It's not hard at all to do. And, uh, and we'll do that in just a sec. So without further ado, I'm Sean Kent. I'm Max Kent. Well, I will be. I'm Annabelle Kent. She's off camera. And we're the Creepy Cat. bombs the first thing when you're doing a kid's face it's usually a good idea because we're gonna be putting latex and stuff like that on him it's usually a good idea that we start by protecting his pretty little face so the first step in that is to put on some sort of cream now you can use just about any cream that's a that's that's a moisturizer because we don't want his skin to dry out tonight okay and the next thing is we are going to put in some white petroleum jelly of nondescript variety. Put a little bit on my hands, keep your eyes closed, and I'm gonna smear that on the sides where his hair is. Hey, yo. So we smear the last of this Vaseline on Max, and then uh, with that excess, I don't know how to put on my hair. Ooh, it's beautiful. Perfect, how do I look? You look beautiful. We're like twins. What do we need to do next? Put the smelly latex on my face. The smelly latex, which I happen to have right here. Right like that. Pretty cool, How'd huh? How'd you do that? I'm pretty amazing that way. So this is just uh, run-of-the-mill latex. There's nothing really fancy about it. Basically, you can get premium latex, which is probably better for the skin, if I'm honest. Now, the, the cheaper stuff like this, it just smells bad. So the first step, and this is kind of a trick, is what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the latex and I'm gonna use this pad here because I can really sort of control where it goes and we're just gonna dab it over the top of his eyelids and a little bit in the middle just like this with this but we're gonna try and avoid getting it on the eyebrow as much as possible. Paper towel me! Totally, I'll Ooh, never yeah. ever catch anything. Right? And then we take that little piece of paper towel here, right? And just for the first start, we're going to take that piece of paper towel, we're going to put it right over the eye. Like oh, that. Oh, just like that. And then what we're going to do is we peel it back it? around the excess edges of the latex. And then we go around where the latex is, staying close to the eyebrow. And what oh. that's going to do is it's gonna protect Max's eyebrow from getting latex in it, which is kind of the idea. Okay, so that's basically it. Max, you are just about ready for your makeup. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna to switch to time-lapse, I'm gonna change places, and you're gonna see us do all the latex. <laughs> Thank you. 
Halloween dance? Yeah. Did you have a good time? Yeah. Yeah. Held up pretty good, eh? We, yeah. we had a little bit of a tear here. It only teared because I was pulling the middle part to terrify people. Was it working? Yeah. They were getting scared? Some person went. Yeah. So what, like to three hours? Yeah. I think of dance party action. Yeah. And uh, it held up pretty good. That concludes today's episode of The Creepy Kid. I'm Sean Kent. I'm Max Kent. And we're the Creepy Kids! Well, I was in the Creepy Kids, now I'm a dead body. Oh. Uh. Ah. <laughs>